Computer Science and Business Systems What is the difference between Computer Science Engineering and Computer Science and Business Systems? The top IT giant, TCS, to meet out Industry 4.0, one syllabus frame. One CSE is the one who has learned a Computer Science Engineer, one who has learned a Industry 4.0 needs to meet the Industry 4.0 needs. If you have a plan, you will have a CSBS in the syllabus. Okay, what is the difference between CSE and CSBS? In CSE, if you have a student who has learned a Computer Science Engineer, For example, C programming, object-oriented programming, Python programming, data structures, operating system, computer networks, DBMS, software engineering, computer network security, cloud computing, machine learning. இது எல்லா பேப்பர்சுமே CSBS STUDENTSும் படிக்கிறாங்க. CSEல நாலு mathematical paper படிப்பாங்க. ஒரு computer engineer நாலே strong mathematical foundation இருக்கனும். So, that's why CSE has 4 max papers. In this CSBS, normal engineering max 1, 2, you can learn how to do discrete mathematics. Why? If you have a computer engineer, you can plan that correctly in this CSBS. If you have a computer engineer, you can learn how to do the latest technology. In this digital technology, data science, machine learning, இது அடிக்கடி கேட்டுட்டே இருப்போம். சோ அப்பா, data science, machine learning ஓட strong fundamentals என்ன? Nothing but statistics. Statistical methods, statistical modeling, computational statistics. சோ அந்த statistics, எங்க இயும் apply பண்டுராங்க, அதுக்கு என்ன language use பண்டுராங்க? அதை கரக்டா CSBSல படிக்கிறாங்க. CSE படிக்கிற students, CSBSல என்ன படிக்கில? ஒரு CSE student, engineering chemistry படிப்பாங்க, engineering graphics, engineering drawing, digital principle and system design, microprocessor and microcontroller, professional ethics and values, then advanced English communication skills. This is a CSE student. This is a CSBS student. In addition to that, CSBS is a student. Design thinking and operation research is a specific paper. If you are an engineer, how do you think about a project and how do you approach a project? So, this paper is studied by computer science and CSBS students. Apart from that, Introduction to Innovation IP Management is a paper. How do we convert the project and how do we approach the innovative approach? So, how do we convert the next business strategy to a start-up? That's how we study it. Every semester, we study a management paper. For example, Fundamentals of Economics, Financial Management, Fundamentals of Management, Business Strategy, Marketing Management, then Human Resource Management. This is all in CSBS. If you study a business engineer, in the management papers. Okay. So, computer science engineering, you can study all papers. In addition, you can study in the management papers. What is it? To make computer engineer as a business engineer. Okay, business engineer. What are you doing? What are you doing? Job roles, job opportunities. They can become data analyst, software developer, software engineer, then data engineer, then machine learning architect, data and analytic manager, database administrator. So they can play the what are all the roles a computer science engineer can do. CSBS students panalam. In addition to that, you have a business analyst arklam, or a leading roles le any IT industries or any industries, they can become a leading role. As a business engineers. So, one normal computer science engineer is what they are learning with the latest digital technologies, with the full practical knowledge. In addition to that, a practical technical communication skills along with managerial skills and business values. So, CSBS is they can become a business engineers, which is the need for today's industry 4.0.